Hi, this is Dr. Vivek. If you want to increase your immunity, you don't want to have mucus in your throat, in your lungs. If you want to be warm in the winters, you don't want to get ill in the winters, then in this video, I'll be sharing with you a simple tea that you can make at home with just two ingredients and this can help you. Very easy to make can drink it two times in a day, morning and evening. What are the ingredients and how to make it? The first ingredient that we will use is cinnamon. Buy the original cinnamon. The link I'll put off the old video where I have explained the difference in the description box. Just have a look, the real cinnamon is available all over the world now. You can find it on internet. I'll try to put the links also in the description box. But the thing is buy cinnamon and use it one fourth teaspoon. Why we are using cinnamon? Because it is antiviral, antibacterial, antifungal spices plus it helps to keep your heart healthy and also works on your pancreas and balances the insulin in your body. How much? One fourth teaspoon. We will add it in the water. Water we will take one glass. It's 200 milliliters. Then we will take ginger. Yes, the raw ginger, not the powder. Because Ayurveda, the holistic medical science says that the raw ginger in small amount balances all the three doshas that are the vata, pitta, kapha. But if you will take the dried one and the powder one, then it can give effect on the pitta, means the fire component of the body. Why we are using the ginger over here? Because ginger will boost your metabolism. And if you'll have good metabolism, the food will not stay in your gut for long. And the food that stays long in your gut is known as ama, means the toxins in your body. So ginger will help you in the detoxification. It will boost your metabolism. Plus, it also gives good effect to your liver, which indeed will help in good bile production. And this concentrated good amount of bile will go to your gallbladder and your gallbladder will be healthy. There will be less chances of getting the gallbladder stone. And plus, at last, this bile, what it will do? It will help our body to digest the food we are eating, to get the more vitamins and minerals from the food that we have eaten. We'll use the fresh ginger root. This much size you can take. Peel off, crush it, and then put it in the same water where you have poured the cinnamon. Boil it on the medium flame. Keep it boiling for two minutes and that's all. Your tea is ready to drink. If you don't like the taste, then you can add a little bit of honey to it. But always remember, honey should not be added in the hot tea. So when it cools down a bit, means about 40 degrees Celsius or a little less, then you can add the honey to it. Either you can just Add lemon if you want or lime juice according to your taste and you can drink it. This tea is going to do magic for you. It is going to help you in your digestion when to drink. I will suggest not to drink it on empty stomach. I will suggest to drink it with food, after food or between your meals that you don't have an empty stomach. So you will have very less chances of having any of the side effects of ginger. For some people, on empty stomach, ginger, cinnamon, they can cause irritation in the stomach. They can cause discomfort in the stomach. So drinking it with the food or just after the food or between the meals, it can help you. But anyways, if you have these sensation, then this tea is not for you. Try for any other one. But for maximum people, this tea is going to help you. Ayurveda, the holistic medical science says both the herbs are going to balance the three doshas. Vata, Pitta, Kapha, especially they are for the Kapha means the mucus in our body. It will remove or reduce the mucus from your body. And plus it pacifies the Vata also means the air component of your body. If taken a lot, both the herbs, then they can cause the Pitta, the fire disbalance means burning skin problems and these kinds of stuff. But if taken a lot, one or two times in a day, I don't think there should cause any of the issues with maximum of the people. Very good tea to be used in the winters. You can play with it. You want to add a little bit of turmeric and black pepper as you want. But these two things are the main ingredient of this tea. Add them 
enjoy your winters stay happy stay healthy